Hello everyone, welcome to the Hard Reset channel and today I'll tell you how you can improve the battery life of your iPhone 16e. So if you are noticing that your battery power has been going down faster recently, uh, what you can do is, uh, the first thing I'm going to show you that you can do is to just go to the control center and check every single like uh, option that you have enabled. So for example, Wi-Fi, AirDrop, Bluetooth, VPN, personal hotspot, all of that stuff. So <clears throat> all of these options are uh, draining your battery faster because like they're always on, they're always looking, the Bluetooth is always looking for new devices. AirDrop is looking for new contacts to AirDrop to and personal hotspot always shares like your network. So those things also can quickly drain your power. So power. So what I suggest doing is just turn off Bluetooth, turn off AirDrop when you're not using them and that should improve your battery life significantly. The next thing I'm going to show you is to open up the settings, then go to battery, so click on battery, then click on battery health and charging and check the capacity of your phone's battery. So basically what that means is the battery is now, uh, now has 89% of the capacity that it had when the phone has been bought. So basically when you buy your phone new, it has 100%, which means that your battery is used up uh, is using all of the of, all of the percentages of your phone and right now if it's like for example at 89 like mine that means that there is less percentages to be used up so basically that means that there is less battery that can uh, power that can be st stored and the next thing i want to tell you is if you hear someone tell you to just close all of the apps like this on your phone that isn't really a solution because uh, what your phone basically does is the iPhone doesn't store uh, apps like the Android phones or other phones using RAM but basically does is it uses other means to uh, save the opened apps in your phone and uh, it doesn't really drain your uh, battery that much which which is also why there isn't a uh, close uh, like all apps option for example like on an Android so there is usually a button right here on the bottom for Androids to close up all of the tabs immediately to free up some RAM. But there is no such such thing on an iPhone because it's not totally needed. And that's about it. What you can also do is just to enable a low, po low power mode, which is uh, done by just, if you don't have it in the control center, what you can do is just click on add a control and then find low power mode and click on it. As you can see, it has been added. And what it basically does is just uh, uh, disables background refresh of the apps. Uh, it uh, disables the. It usually turns off the screen after a few inactive minutes, and uh, controls like the brightness of your screen, which you can do by yourself by just uh, going to the control center and uh, changing <coughs> changing the brightness of your screen, which also helps helps a lot. And that's about it. Thank you for watching. I hope this video helps and make sure to like and subscribe.